Biometric technologies are becoming increasingly popular for use in UK policing, but this has raised issues concerning privacy, freedom of movement, bias and discrimination, and public trust in law enforcement. The UK's Biometrics Commissioner, Fraser Sampson, recently addressed Parliament's Joint Committee on Human Rights to discuss the potential positive impacts of biometric data and underline the urgent need for clear, comprehensive, and coherent frameworks to regulate police use of AI and biometrics. Sampson warned of a non-deletion culture in policing, where even when an individual is not convicted of a crime, biometric records, such as custody images, DNA and fingerprints, are still retained. According to Sampson, this is both a legal problem and a public trust issue, as citizens have no guarantee that their biometric information will be deleted. I'm here today saying there are probably several million of those records still, said Sampson. The Biometrics Commissioner noted that while some forces have started providing discharge information regarding deletion of custody images, it is still up to individuals to pursue deletion of their records, and that there is no guarantee that requests will be honored. Sampson's report, which was sent to the Home Office in November 2022, called for clear, comprehensive and coherent frameworks to regulate police use of AI and biometrics in the UK, with human rights being utmost priority. And while the UK government is yet to publish its AI white paper, it is clear that legislation needs to be put in place to ensure public trust in law enforcement and guarantee citizens' digital rights are upheld.